guess where I'm at? I'm at California State University, Long Beach, and this pyramid behind me doesn't hold mummies, it actually holds athletes. Pretty unique, huh? I'm Nicole Aaron, and let's start this tour. California State University Long Beach is located in Long Beach, California. We are just miles from the mountains, and so during their breaks, if they like to go skiing, that's not a problem. Disneyland is right down the way, so they can participate and attend, uh, go to Disneyland. The beaches are about five minutes away, so when they're not studying, or they can take their books and, and lay out on the beach and enjoy that. Cal State Long Beach is a sprawling 322-acre campus and houses over 100 buildings. It's the perfect mixture of green space with 3,200 peach trees and state-of-the-art facilities. CSULB has nearly 33,500 students, about 4,000 of whom are first-time freshmen. Even though it's a big campus, um, Within your own major department, it really feels like a small community, so you don't feel too overwhelmed by all the students. Women outnumber the men 60 to 40 percent, and ethnically there is no majority group. The beach is popular with international students too, with more than 1,300 students from 90 countries attending every year. We have really rich, varied discussions because the students all come from different walks of life and share their experiences in a really mutually respectful way. We were uh, ranked amongst the top 10 universities in the nation as far as applications to the university. Uh, our students are highly competitive uh, in terms of the typical GPA. We're talking about uh, about a 3.5, about 1,100 in terms of their um, SAT scores. For a full-time in-state undergraduate student, the average cost of yearly tuition is about $5,500, while those coming from out of state will pay the same plus $372 per unit. Check out the President's Scholar Program, which offers full scholarships including housing costs. I am a Presidential Scholar here at Cal State Long Beach. Uh, that is a four-year paid tuition, uh, room and board, everything's included. Uh, we also get a $200 book stipend per year, so we get to use that at the bookstore for our books and supplies. CSU Long Beach has been consecutively ranked as one of the top five public comprehensive universities in the West by U.S. News and World Report. Princeton Review agrees with them, saying that they're the best in the West. The university offers 86 baccalaureate degrees, 67 master's degrees, and two doctoral degrees in seven academic colleges, as well as 74 minors and 38 programs leading to educational credentials. We're the largest um, single campus university in the CSU. But although we're largest, we do have small learning communities, so students don't feel like they're a number when they come onto the campus. As I mentioned, they all go through student uh, orientation programs, so they have a nice, successful transition. They feel comfortable with the university. We have a great commitment also to advising, both in our programs, but across the university, I would say. So we have, it's a great big university in many ways, but it has a very small university feel. Our students get kind of one-on-one uh, -on -one interaction with faculty. They get to know all the other students within their program, and of course they have access to all these great beach and marine environments only three miles from campus. They're very good at working closely with you and helping you uh, not only have the knowledge, but the necessary skills to survive outside, and I'm going to grad school, so my professor uh, in the Marine Biology Department has met with me for hours, uh, just in preparing me, helping me get good personal statements and also giving me the skills in order to do research in the future. The five most popular baccalaureate programs are Liberal Studies, Communications, Studio Art, Nursing, and Biology. So the great thing about teaching marine biology is it's a very hands-on field. So we get to take our students out in the field, we do a lot of field trips, they get to go out on boats, and many of the things that we're teaching them reinforces what they learn in lecture, but it also gives them that kind of hands-on experience that they're going to need to get a job in this field. Cal State Long Beach professors stay connected to their students, keeping class sizes small. In total, there are 1,886 faculty members, about half of whom are full-time. Professors are just phenomenal. I, I can't say enough good things about them. Uh, they are willing to meet with you at any time of the day. Their doors are always open and uh, they uh, will help you with whatever that's going on, whether it be a school issue, a life issue, um, whatever, they're, they're always there and they are willing to be not only your professor, but your friend. Go Beach! You'll hear that chant as the underclassmen cheer on the 49ers as their 18 varsity sports teams compete at the Division I level in the Big West Conference. Come on, guys! 
give it up for the ladies. The volleyball team has won three national titles, one national runner-up, and eight Final Four appearances. The beach has 18 residence hall buildings accommodating over 2,400 students. Living on campus costs about $10,000 a year, depending on what meal plan you purchase. You can even get academic assistance in the residence halls. Students take advantage of these learning communities with on-site classes, tutoring, and advising. We have over 300 different clubs and organizations that students can get involved in. Fabulous, new state-of-the-art Rec and Wellness Center that just opened for our students. Cal State Long Beach breeds some of today's most elite athletes. MLB slugger Jason Giambi and Evan Longoria both attended the university. A natural fit for the beach, professional beach volleyball player and two-time Olympic gold medal winner, Misty May Trainer is an alum. Plus, funny man Steve Martin and Academy Award winning director Steven Spielberg both received degrees. It's hard to pick my favorite spot on campus, but this Japanese garden is pretty much on the top of my list. What a perfect way to end this tour. I'm Nicole Aaron for University TV. Beach Pride!